why would you need a helping friend or a study buddy to help you out uh, when you have chat gpt you can ch use chat gpt when you are stuck you are stuck with your studies or your homework etc uh, because it is very advanced and ai uh, created up to date so uh, one of m someone gave me this task to do apa references let me just show it to you so someone gave me uh, APA references uh, worksheet okay to do this uh, worksheet so uh, I needed to complete this and uh, you can see when I zoom in over here if I like going through each one of this try finding out the you see a short story by Langdon Jones uh, the eye of the lens so I need to read each one uh, each one of them get the title of the book the author of the book and the uh, and the yeah, editor name and the publisher name etc and then uh, i need to put it in the find the correct format for the apa and then i put it in okay so there is a different format for a article there is different for uh, format for podcast there is different format for a book and various other things so for each one there is different format and you you need to uh, even if you are doing with the uh, Microsoft Word or etc., you will need to uh, identify the information like the year of publication, name of author, etc., and then you will need to put uh, put it in for like uh, for it to create a correct API reference. So that takes a lot of time. So in order to save time, you can you easily use Chat GPT. So uh, let me just show you. But firstly, uh, I took pictures of this. You see. I need to copy the text and then put it in chat GPT. If I try to manually type this text into chat GPT, it is going to take me a lot of time. So what I did, uh, what I am going to do, I am going to show you right now. I am going to use a image to text, image to text converter online. So I will just get some we image to text i just write i used one actually okay i used this one before so i'll just show this one okay okay what i'm going to do right now suppose i want to firstly i'll just i'll just uh, upload this image over here Okay, I'll drag and drop this over here and and okay, it's uploading. Okay, uh, I'll need to click over here submit. Then it will just convert. Okay, let's do the recapture over here. Okay, doing the recapture. Okay, mountain or hills. Uh, okay, fine. Okay, it's converting. So, just almost done. Okay, converted all of the text in this image into this nicely uh, text which I can simply copy and paste. Okay. So, firstly let us see this one a short story. So, I will need this to convert this to APA reference. A short story entitled the eye of lens uh, by Langdon Jones included anthology the title worlds edited by uh, Michael Morock. The story is found on the 101 to 140. The book was published by Fortana paperbacks in 1983 in London, uh, UK. So, uh, what what is the thing is that uh, you uh, over here the this enti uh, entitled sorry that eye of the lens this is the title of the book and Landon Jones over here is the author of the book and uh, Michael Morrow over here is the editor and the studios found uh, the Fontana paperbacks was uh, is is the publisher and 1983 is the publishing year okay 
So, you see that manually identifying each of the information and then putting finding the correct APA format and putting uh, putting in did that format is going to take you around like like uh, 5 minutes, 3 minutes. So, it is a lot of time if you like multiply with uh, 5 into 20 uh, then it is going to be 100 minutes. So, lot of time lot of time wasted. So, what I am going to do is I am going to simply copy this one which I need to convert to into a correct of APA reference. Then I go to chat GPT then I simply say write correct APA reference for this then in quotation marks I will simply paste in all of the things ok. Then hit enter and then you see that you will just wait a bit sometimes uh, chat GPT takes a bit of time ok it is writing. Fontana paperbacks. See it wrote everything in correct format. You see over here uh, the name of the author at the beginning is inverted. The first Jones is coming first, the last name Jones coming first and the Langdon L initial is uh, coming second and in 1983 the publishing date the, which they included this is the title of the book which they have included over here in M. Morocco. You see the editor name uh, perfectly written the initial first name initial is going to come first and the last name initial is going to go the after that because uh, when you write uh, someone's name in the next after uh, next like not in the first part in the next part then it is the, the first name initial should go first and then the last name ok. And uh, new worlds ok I am not sure ok this is the publishers name London UK paperback. So, you see that it without in seconds it like uh, like you it would have been taken you around 5 minutes or 6 minutes uh, like uh, to find the like to identify the, all the information like the author name, publisher, editor, year of publications, uh, publisher name and if there is translator. Uh, so, you need to and for that you will need to correct the right format APA format and then you will need to put the all of this in this in that format. So, it is a major uh, huge waste of time, uh, but it only took chat GPT uh, a mere seconds to like to produce this simple APA reference. Uh, so, it is going to like save your tons of time. So, I will just suggest you to use chat GPT more uh, instead of wasting your time in stupid uh, like uh, silly educational systems over here we have. So, it is great. So, I hope uh, this video helped you out if you did if it did then please make sure to like this video and also please make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.